Enderman. Steve. Or in this case, Enderman. Enderman. Uh, we can go out here on small battlefield to start us off. Connor versus MRW losers finals. Let's get it. So, Connor, just walking his cat, walking his cat, taking a walk. Down tilt, another down tilt. Looking to catch him, puts the block down. Taking your cat for a walk day, baby. Just trying to do it again. Own a, own his pizza song, man. He loves this song. Is he dead? He jumps off and gets himself stuck underneath the block. Huge miscue for MRW. That's going to be the first knock taken in a really goofy fashion. As we're going to see the uh, Darkness Larry take himself off stage again. That's very strange to do against Connor right now. Just taking you for a little bit of a ride. The repeater and the fair gets him stuck in the minecart. Can he get the spike? And he does! That's going to be a kill again! A zero to death in a very, very quick fashion for Connor. Put yourself in a bad position. That'll happen to you. Oh. Waiting it out. Connor is looking mighty comfortable all of a sudden. Rolls on, F tilt. Here comes the up tilt. Back air. And here we go. Spike him down. Carry him up again. MRW's just has to find a stock sooner or later. Gonna get hit by the up smash. Here we go. Back to the plank. Not a bad idea, honestly. Make him come to you. Yeah, he's fine with it. <laughs> come on now. <laughs> oh my god! Connor clears off the ledge with it. Oh! <laughs> Just SD. Just SD. You're done. The set's over. It's over! He's ricocheting you off the blocks! <laughs> Come on now! <laughs> Just. He, oh my god. Toying with his food, sets it up, tries to go for the F smash. Up smash, I apologize. Just scoop him. If MRW comes back from this, this is going to be like the most... Nope, you're dead. You're dead. Up throw. Up throw. Funny game, going to Northern Cave. Got the one winged angel, he's got boss mode out. Stop battle! Seth Aral. <laughs> he's not gonna do it, he's not gonna do it. He's gonna go with the instant roar. Alright. Alright, here we go. Game two. Starting us off, setting up only part of the F. Down tilt coming in. Just sneaks in with those up tilts as well, keeping these going up air. Catches them down with the up smash as well. Connor, keeping it going. Going absolutely nuts. Another two fares. Spiking him down and hitting him again. Trying to go for the F smash, but he can't get it. This time it's MRW time. Did some damage going. Doesn't get the lead. Oh, he gets it this time. Yeah, that's going to be a ton of damage. Already up to 122. It's a violent uh, Lolan whip right there. It says Alola, baby. Yeah, he's just kind of letting him mine, and now he's going to use that mine card. Couldn't get the back air, does get a grab. MRW now off stage. Have to recovery in kind, and ends up sending him up to the top. Takes that first stock, MRW. Says playtime's over. Put your toys away. Down throw, gets the up air as well. Let's go for the Alolan Whip, can't get it, goes right to the platform, down smash, sending him off. And there's the Anvil to take the stock, MRW. Losing that first stock, keeping it close though. Here comes the Jabs. Diamond doing a lot of work right there. Already up to 77%, waits for the punish right there. Gets the landing as well with the air dodge. There. has revenge. We're probably going to see an Alolan Whip attempt. It's probably going to be successful to be honest with you. Oh, he's just going to wait it out. He has to go down for it. You 
think he's still got it too, so he's fine with flanking. He's fine with waiting out. Gets the back air though. Does slip out and he gets hit by the minecart on his way, trying to come back up, and that's gonna be the second stock gone. MRW made a smart play, but Connor had a had an answer for it. Taking his cat for a walk day all the way across the stage. Lost his pickaxe, gets this F smash, and that's gonna get countered. That's gonna do a ton of damage if he hits with it, but the grab it's gone, just like that. That advantage he had, taken completely away, rolls behind, can't get the F smash. Jabs through, MRW now. Jab. But MRW kind of just armors through it. Back to the ledge we go. Yeah. <laughs> there is somewhere. Oh! And the anvil gonna take game two. I think you were told specifically from Zambo to only speak Spanish. The other mic has completely and utterly disappeared. Oh, right there. <laughs> it's in the bag. Yeah, it's a... Uh, it's been a mess today. <laughs> but we got it. We're, we're doing okay. We're here. We're in losers finals. It's uh... 2-0, Connor is up. Yeah, and I mean, after that first game, Connor pretty much, he had full control, but MRW looked good that second game. You can tell he was starting to get more comfortable, uh, starting to use all of his tools effectively. So what is the tail of the tape between these two usually? I know it's not their first rodeo here. It's definitely not. Um, I would say Connor usually has a bit of an advantage. Um, I mean, MRW is known as the, uh, the Steve Destroyer. Oh. of the region. I mean, he does know this matchup very well. He's doing quite well now, but I know it only takes a little bit for them to get started. Exactly, yeah. Like, once Steve gets his hands on you and he's able to get it going kind of like this, and there you go off the side with the fair. Looking for a spike, maybe? No, Pops not to. My god, that up, up tilt. So up tilt, up air, all of it. Unbelievable. The juggles that you can He's get. just building an obstacle course for you right now. <laughs> like, have fun playing neutral, nerd. I'm... <laughs> building over here. Exactly. It's like, hang on, I gotta build you a jungle gym. Responsibilities, gotta get stuff for my house later. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta I gotta go mining. Well, I gotta get that diamond. I gotta no, get he that could plank like that. Yeah, it's insane. And then he, every time he touches the block, it resets your invincibility, but he reads the roll in. Incredible read. Very smart. Part of me wonders, did he have that scouted out earlier, or did he just go for it? I keep hearing that it's a, you, you can react to the roll. But that, that just looked like a hard read. He was charging that for like a singular second beforehand. But yeah, yeah, I was going to say, he knew exactly where it was coming. And there's the back air right there. As After MRW getting in the low whip, which is, uh, you know, a pretty hefty amount of damage. Just going to turn around, get that up smash, scoop him up. Yeah, quite, quite a risky, quite a risky LP there. But just being fearful of the TNT. Yeah, TNT. The TNT, yeah. It definitely uh, puts the fear of God in you. And trying to go for the fair right there is Connor. Ooh, very nice reversal on the block there, using the down smash. Yeah, I mean, like, you see a lot of Steve's use that exact setup, but this time MRW using it in his favor, but this time also... Very cute and cheeky, but holy shit, so is that. Yeah, gold tools, man, coming out in spades. Almost literally, he doesn't have a shovel, though, so... Oh, there you go. You, you, thought, you thought you waited it out, but it's good forward smash you anyway. Yeah, it didn't matter, yeah, I guess a, a frame 10 F smash will do that to you. <laughs> Gets a down throw. Oh, here we go. What's next? Spike? Are we going to see another one? No. I mean, those tools got to be pretty, uh, looking pretty worse for wear, I would assume. They are gold, so they're a little less durable, but they are faster. I'm sure MRW is going to want to keep this heat on him, not let him even build up to a diamond. Oh, absolutely, yeah. I think <gasps> the spot dodge, that's going to work out really well for Connor, but he can't get all the combo off. The Darkest Lariat as well, putting on some damage for MRW. Here we go. Building himself up here. He's got a little bit of diamond. I think you need four. I think gold. You need four gold to get gold tools. You know, I clearly don't know as, as much as these great players, but I, I'd beg to imagine that uh, it might be worth trying to edge guard him even when he's planking like that. It's a little rough because if you do go out there, we saw it earlier. Uh, MRW went for a back air, ended up off stage because uh, Connor. I don't like went... my opponent feeling too comfortable though. You know what I mean? I Just know what like, you're what saying. Do you yeah. I think I'm a, a wimp. Oh, I'll <laughs> you go out there, man. You calling me a cow? Yeah, what, what you think? You stop me once, I'm gonna just stop? Just not gonna go out there again? Never do it again? Yeah, no, unbelievable. No way. Yeah. Prove yourself. <laughs> <laughs> do it twice. Yeah, do it twice. You man. won't. <laughs> or, you're not a real man otherwise, exactly. obviously. Yeah. yeah. Call out your masculinity. <laughs> <laughs> Fragile man. <laughs> like, look at you blanking me here. 
I know I'm scary. Oh, it's one. Go okay, it's one. Go Got it. Got you. Thanks. All right. Th thanks for the, the help in chat. But that's gonna be an F smash to the face. 3-0 for Connor, and he's gonna walk straight into the grand finals. Uh, that's that seems like a rough set, man, for MRW. Like.